heartbeat. Hey, also, just in case y'all wasn't aware, on PlayStation... Hey, guess what, folks? We are live. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> we are live. Uh, before, we went, before we went live, we were talking about um, Brenda ooh-wooing for the community. No. <laughs> Why'd you have to bring it up? I will not. Come on, Brenda, ooh-woo. Ooh, I love the U W U. That's all you're getting. <laughs> you say U W U. Okay, so welcome to the LNG show, late night edition. Before we start, <laughs> viewer discretion is advised. Again, this is an 18 and plus stream because it's late at night time and it's only for the adults. So 21 plus. 12, 15. Yeah, 21 plus. New, new, new day. So. Just remember that things are going to get a little bit sexual. They may get a little bit raunchy. They may get a little bit out of control, but this is just for the conversation. So, back to this ooh woo business. No. <laughs> I'm, I'm not, I, I don't even know what that is. <laughs> when you say ooh woo, I'm thinking. Don't want to explain it to him. Like, when you say ooh woo, I was thinking of the old app, you know, the video chat app, the O O V O O. That's that's. That's what I was Not Uvu. Not Uvu. No. Not Uvu. That's Uvu. That, we're talking so, about Uvu. I have no clue what you're talking about, man. Uvu. <laughs> just, just, just don't worry about it. It's just uh, Uvu. This is, oh my uh, god. This it's game. um basically weeb talk for Ugh. cutesy voice. That's all. The girls that go on... Either whatever they're streaming stuff, or they're on TikTok or whatever, they have these little like squeaky girly voices, and they ooh woo and they ask you for stupid things, and then guys send them money, ridiculous amounts of money just for that. Oh, that's a real thing. Yeah, it's a real thing. <laughs> Some shit people do. We call them simp's. I mean, it's a yeah. real thing when fucking that one girl, Bella Daphne, where the fuck her name is. <laughs> Sold her fucking bath water and sold out. Now, first of I all, told first you, of all, I told first you, I told you, gonna have Sneak sell his hot dog water. Hot dog water. <laughs> <laughs> hot dog water. <laughs> what do you say? What? <laughs> so your bath ooh, water. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, they won't want my bath water, sir. They won't want my bath water. They want Brenda's bath water, though. We can sell Brenda's bath no. water. Or Becca's no, bath we're water. selling we're selling Sneak's bath huh? water. <laughs> Becca, his hot dog water. water. His hot dog water. Hold on, we, we already sell... know the label that we're gonna use for it. We can sell Brent. No, not not Brent. We can sell Becca's bath bath water too. Ah, uh, yes. She ha she has a voice Sen for it. The um shy voice. Sense. Sense from LNG. <laughs> from she's so awkward is funny. <laughs> she's so awkward is funny. <laughs> she, yeah, we're gonna put her on camera and be like, okay, Becca, say ooh woo. <laughs> put her put her into a cat outfit. Cat ears and cat tails yeah. take ooh for the camera. No. <laughs> Actually, look, look at her little icon. Yeah, her little icon sense. is definitely cutesy. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Say ooh, say ooh, woo, Becca. Say ooh, woo. Come on, Becca. Say ooh, woo. <laughs> say ooh, woo, Becca. <laughs> she said no. Okay. So, so, how is everybody doing today? Like. Anything interesting happened in you guys' day? <laughs> Wait, oh. Okay, yeah, well, let's give this one to Sneak. <laughs> okay, Sneak. <laughs> what <Go> happened? Ahead. <laughs> HP and Walmart's on my fucking shit list. <laughs> <laughs> what did HP do to you? <laughs> what do they do to me? Ship out a fucking computer that don't work. <laughs> how much did you pay? How much did you pay for that computer? Exact like four hundred something, five hundred something. Four twenty nine plus tax. Damn. They got you, Sneak. They got you. No, they didn't, because I'm, oh, I'm going to go back there and fucking they beat the hell you. out of somebody. They got you for your paper. <laughs> oh, God. Nope. Yes, they did. They fooled you. I feel bad for whoever's behind that customer service desk when I get up there tomorrow, because I'm just going to yell at them like it's their fault. <laughs> well, technically, it's Walmart's fault, so, I mean, Walmart can be a piece of crap sometimes, a piece of shit. It ain't. This is why. It ain't their fault that the person has to say that the product was defective. They just sell it. They don't make it, so they ain't really on that. They sold it. I believe that all retail people should check their merchandise before selling. At least once. To make sure I works. think that the company should make sure that shit works before sending it out. I mean, that could have got that thing could have 
messed up between the time they got shipped out and the time they got to the store. It could have, but what, but, but what would have fucked up the fucking uh, part like that from transport from well, A to B? It is the Travel? power Probably. supply. Power supply? And apparently, Jesus looked it up and said, oh, these models have... I was like, so... Actually, no, I'm going to rip him a new one, too, because I told him which model I had, was getting, and he didn't bother to tell me it might be broken until I bought it. Well, you know how Jesus is. He's a more of a learn-on-your-own type of guy. Like, he'll yeah, he'll tell you one thing, and then, you know, he's like, oh, well, you can do, you can do what you want. Because he did tell you to wait. He did tell you to wait. In all fairness, wow. he did tell you to wait. Can I tell sneaky shit, though? <laughs> <laughs> Not at all. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Think you do what the fuck he want? Like I said, to to defend him, he did. Uh, uh I'm drinking Corona right now, so right now I'm talking. Where is your lime, you. sir? Oh, he's lo- ex- I'm sending him lime. <laughs> Where is I'm your sending- lime? I'm literally. First sending off, him I lime. got these at I got these at my work. I work at a gas station for everyone watching. <laughs> uh, I'm not getting limes from a gas station. Fuck that. Why? Because I might come back with like seven heads or something. Well, I'm sending you limes in the mail. What kind, what kind of... Yes, I'm that serious about the limes. I mean, Chris, you're turning it over a new leaf, so you might need the lime. Tropical Mexican and all. <laughs> so I have a question for Ooh. everybody. Ooh, this, here is, we go. this is pretty. This is pretty awkward. I'm not gonna lie. This is pretty awkward, but. It... <laughs> Have any of you guys had sex with anybody, and in the middle of it, you realize this ain't it? And like, you realize in the middle of it, like, oh, this ain't it. Like, this is not, this is not what I want. Mistakes were made. <laughs> Mistakes were definitely made. See, I, would, I have a perfect example of that, but I feel like my story is a little bit way too dark. Uh, well, well, I'm I, not gonna say. No, no, I, we need to hear this now. I, now I'm curious. We have peak night. It's curiosity. dark. I need to it's hear. It's really this. dark. I need to hear it. I need to hear it. Come on. I need to hear. It. Come on. Come on. I need to hear it. I have. I have quite a few stories like that. <laughs> I like that. Nah. Okay. Okay. I'll start it off, and then everyone else's story will kind of wash off the darkness because it's pretty dark. Okay. So, when I was 15, I got raped. Right. And in the process of being raped, I remember very vividly, like, being there, laying there, and I'm just like, first thoughts is like, oh, shit, like, I'm getting raped. But then it's like, this is it. This is, because it was my first time. So I was like, this this is it. This was, oh, wow. And then I thought, I'm like, maybe I'm gay. Like, no, like, this just, like, this is what sex is? Wow. Like, what's the hype? Meh. I regret acting. Mm. And that was it. And I literally, I remember it so well because, like, you would think that the worst thing I was thinking about was, like, hey, I'm getting raped. No, the bi- the biggest thing I was thinking about was, like, man, this is pretty fucking whack. This is meh. That ain't it. This ain't <laughs> it. This ain't it, damn. I and I really thought I was maybe, like, I was, like, super fucking gay. I'm like, maybe this is what it is. I'm like, but no. This is just, no, this wasn't that. Let's just, let's just <laughs> go on record that I regret asking. And I, did I told not you know, it was really dark. I didn't know it was oh, that dark. It was, it was dark as hell. I did not know it was that dark. I, I, said I did that not. I that was my fault. I played with fire. <laughs> I get it. I played with fire, and I got burned. It uh, was so but it's so funny. I think I personally like it's like it was fifteen. I'm twenty eight now. Did you forget your age? So how did you forget your age? The same age as my sister, and I got. I'm tired. <laughs> I always forget. Look, anyways, I'm 28 now. I'm over it. I'm past that. Except this, so, like now, I kind of just look back and laugh at certain things. That to me is funny because it's not like, hey, the biggest issue was there. It wasn't the biggest issue in the moment. It was just like, oh, well, I remember look like staring at the ceiling. Like, this is it. Ten out of ten would not would not call. Would that not recommend. Back again. That was, would not recommend. Would not recommend. So there was this one time where this is my disheartening story. There was this one time. I was really into this one female, and I chased her for like a month or two, trying to get with her, get in her pants and whatnot. I was like, oh, she was she was so thick, like she was she was fucking so thick, and she was a coworker at a previous job. She was so thick, and then 
like we had sex and as I'm stroking it's like this ain't it like this ain't it like I finished I finished it but I was like really yeah, ah. what wasn't it what was an exp- explain it to me? Describe it. Tell me. Like, okay. Give me okay. the scenery. Give okay, me the mood. So, give me everything. So I we was in the bed. Details. So we was in the bed, and first of all, you know how she how she felt. I didn't feel anything. I'm like, oh, this is I I, I can't feel anything. This is not it. This is so definitely. Kind of like, but it wasn't just the feel. My dog down the hallway. Yeah, it, it, it wasn't just. Mouth. It wasn't just the feel. It was also the smell. Like her pheromone, her smell did not smell right to me. Like it was like uh, it wasn't. She wasn't musty. She wasn't musty at all. It was just her natural scent. It wasn't mm. appealing to me. It was like, oh no. <laughs> Are you sure she wasn't sick? <laughs> cr- I don't know. Creme de Dookie. She might have some shit. I don't know. I don't know, but like I said, this. Was not it, and I wait. I feel like I waste so much time chasing you. Um, like this, that I, must have been a disappointment. It was so. disappointment, and she was so thick too. She was she was so so thick. Like, ooh, she was so thick. Thick, but, thick like cottage cheese. Thick like cottage cheese. Like like the smell of it too. Mm-hmm. That, that's smell why I too. tell people: it don't matter how girls, it don't matter, and guys too. It don't matter how good looking you are. Wash your fucking taint. <laughs> You know what? I think I think um, not exactly one of those type of. It was more like okay, where I dodged, I might have dodged a bullet because someone was being honest with me about something that they had that I wasn't aware of. Mm. Okay, so there again, I'm like 23. Again, in the army, you know, whatever, and I was talking to this girl and. I guess I ended up going to her house to hang out with her. Well, we were going to a barber. I went to her house to like, so she was getting ready. And we were, you know, okay, I'm kind of just sitting around waiting on her. She got out of the shower. We started talking. One thing almost led to another. And she was just like, okay, I got to be honest with you about something. I'm just like, okay. <laughs> and she was just like, and, and she was like, um, uh, maybe we should. And I'm like, what's wrong? I'm like, what? What you got? Crabs or some shit? And she was just like, <laughs> I'm just like, <laughs> like, why are you silent? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, just, I'm waiting for her. And she, yeah, I'm just like, oh. <laughs> like, oh. Ooh. I'm like, we ain't got so She was just like, yeah, you know, it's just, I just want to be honest. But if you want to, I'm like, just get dressed. It's, 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 like, okay. <laughs> First off, I'm not going the Red Lobster. No, thank you. <laughs> And she was, and she still wanted to do it with you too while she had I'm crabs. She was being, I'm glad she was honest. Oh though, god! Because, you know, it wasn't like I was gonna do that unprotected anyway. But last, I've never had an STD. At least, no, no, I've never had an STD. So, um, you don't want we, it. Yeah. It's ooh, like, ooh, I, I got. I, I, ooh, I'm about to fuck everyone's. I'm about to fuck with everyone's head for a second before I tell my story. <laughs> Have you ever gotten a UTI shortly after having sex with somebody? Just just think of all the times you might have had a UTI. Mm, I don't think I've had a UTI, but I have been burnt before. Never. Well, see, the thing with men is even if you had one, you wouldn't be able to tell. Yeah, you wouldn't be able to tell. No, a UTI you would be able to tell because then you... Like, yeah, when can... you pee, it feels like you're pissing razor blades. Okay, mm-hmm. well, I never felt that before then. I never had a UTI then. Oh, then you're lucky. Well, fun fact for everyone watching, UTIs are actually in the sexual uh, transmitted disease family. Uh, some people have a gene to where they can actually just give you a UTI just from having sex with them. So, hold on, okay, because my, my knowledge with that in particular is, no, I'm going to say under normal circumstances, men can get it, but usually if you're not consistently sleeping with a person who has it, it'll go away if, if you're a man. It'll go, you can literally just piss it out and you'll be fine with them, like, I think. Pissing it out? Month? Yeah, yeah. Literally, that's why like a man, you a woman can tell if she has a UTI, but a man can't. And usually, if you do, you usually end up if you just go a month without, I guess, having unprotected sex with whoever you got it from, it goes. That's away. HPV. That's not uh, a UTI. Okay, then no, I don't think I've ever had a UTI. 
the more you wow. know. Wow. <laughs> the more you know. You got, you guys are so lucky. I have never had a UTI before. Like, then, no, I've never a, had a, UTI, had a UTI, you can get them from like a wide range of ways, but I know one way is that there's that weird gene that some people have, but a UTI is like, is like level one of chlamydia. It yeah. burns. I you pee. Called ghost chlamydia. Ghost chlamydia? What the fuck is ghost chlamydia? What is ghost she chlamydia? Told that, she told me that, and I'm just like, and she's like, oh yeah, I caught chlamydia, and I asked my boyfriend, and he said he hadn't been with nobody, so oh, apparently I caught ghost chlamydia, and I'm just like, okay. <laughs> That's fuck not how that works. How, like, what okay. the fuck is ghost chlamydia? <laughs> A ghost who had chlamydia. Casper like, <laughs> like, okay. fucking the wrong ghost or something. <laughs> well, ghost was fucking probably caught her in her sleep. I don't fucking know. I, obviously, I wasn't. Yeah, you see, you seen scary movie too, she right? Told, yeah, she told me. I just oh. reacted to what I was what I was told, and I'm just like, okay, mm-hmm. that whatever. Is... You say. That's ghost weird. chlamydia. Ghost chlamydia. I'm gonna Google hmm. that. I'm definitely gonna Google that in the Google search. Speaking of Google searches, no. speaking of Google <laughs> searches, there is one person t-shirt. here that Google search is so fucked up and messed up. Hmm. I can only imagine her. Mm, me too. Who? Oh. Brenda, you want to share on this? I'm posting that. like in here our 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 show. No, you are. <laughs> yeah, I'm posting it. Uh, what, by you, the way, oh, don't, Google, the don't Google search my name. Why not? Uh, go go on Urban Dictionary and look up, look up what sneaky banana means. Oh no, okay, okay, we know what that is, girl. Okay. So don't don't look up my name. Mm-hmm. Ever. Oh my gosh. So there's there's this post floating around on Facebook about the the world's first space hotel. Okay. Oh wait! Before we get into that, did you see it? Did anyone catch the the launch today, or like the? I guess it arrived. What the arrived? SpaceX Starship landed, yeah. like it landed, landed, and then it went. It, it blew up. Landed where? What is anybody? Yeah, in it there? blew up. No. Um. No. These are all prototypes. Um. Land- they're trying to get it to like Elon Musk, is trying to get it right. I guess. Mm-hmm. And um, yeah, it landed, and okay. then it took a little bit, but then it it popped. So, so what is it? So is this a new kind of prototype for a ship that they're working on? Yeah, they're trying to get it so that you know they can do their their thing, their travel. You know, and he's not giving up. Traveling it, usually how that whole thing works. No, no, I, they're I, trying to I, get I, it right. I didn't even know that was even happening. I didn't know that even exploded, but I guess. The media controls so, everything. So. The other part of nerdiness is like science stuff, which I'm really into, not just anime stuff. I understand that. You're right. Fair point. And I love science. So, yeah, that was really cool. It was really cool to see it land, and then it was just like, which is still cool because it's like they're just getting closer and closer to having a perfected model. Light speed, anyway? It's a very expensive well, prototype. Can't make an omelet if you don't break a few eggs, right? Yeah, but those cost a couple trillion dollar eggs, though. Well, he got the um, he got the money to do it. So, you know, eggs. You know, I'm just saying. That's probably too much to him. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Yeah. Must be. But yeah, space hotel. I don't know. I don't know how that how, how that will work. I know that only the rich and wealthy will be able to afford the space hotel. Even, and their prostitutes. Yeah, and their prostitutes. Yeah. Initially, okay. Though, okay. I feel like after a while they would probably make it affordable for us. Maybe, but it would probably be like another Disneyland, like expensive as shit. Okay, so John, you got, this, is Disneyland. How, this, this is how a space hotel works. Now, I need you to follow with me because it's very complicated. Now, imagine one on Earth. Mm-hmm. Put it on the fucking moon. There you go. Space hotel. Then I talk about it being on the moon. I talk about it being in orbit. Oh, then they'll probably create a mass big enough to actually orbit around the Earth instead of crashing into it. Can you yeah, but you need training to go into space, though. That means that everybody that wants to go into that space hotel has to deal with with the G-Force, and they have to go through training for that. So that means that if I want to go up to the fucking space hotel, I gotta go through the same training that the astronauts go on through. 
and that could be eventually fun. over time they could probably figure that out though they can yeah, probably make probably, a, sh- yeah, a ship fun. where they can lessen the ceiling lessen the the, the intensity they'll figure they, there's always there's always possibilities pretty much mm-hmm. and plus so. you got you got you got to look at it this way it's just like every other okay like okay so i'm i'm, I'm going to get to it for a minute hey, you remember when the dvd players first came out only like you know rich people had those so eventually mm-hmm. they got to the point where they were affordable when iPods first came out, only rich kids had those. Cell phones. Cell phones. Freaking with the big like old packs that. and it'll stuff. Be, it'll be expensive in the beginning, but then they get to a point where they can reach a wider range of people and then make it more affordable for everyone else. And then it'll become that's, regular. That's usually how that type of thing works. Just now, like with, electro- with electronic vehicles, like that's getting pushed <laughs> further and further so it could be our norm. Only the rich people had Teslas. Now it's literally just everyone. You got YouTubers driving around with them like it ain't nothing. They got money. Yeah, they got money. I'm not. I don't see no fucking hood. Nigga. I'm or hood still person me. rather. Hood person in a, in a Tesla. I'm just saying. You know. I've seen actually like at least. You two, need to come to my area and where I two work. Two Teslas in Inglewood. Two Teslas in Inglewood. I ain't seen that one. Tesla. And just I, driving I, I through. Tesla, oh, they're driving through. Of course, just right. driving through. No, 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 no. I was driving through. Oh, you were driving were through. Oh, okay. I thought they were just driving through. Okay, I understand. Like, that. yeah, I've literally been on driving down like 79th and something. You'll see some like, Tesla truck or a car, and just like I've never seen Teslas. Only in downtown. Like, I don't know what the, what's wrong with my luck. I've never seen them. I see. I see Teslas everywhere, even yeah. in Indiana. Hmm. Yeah. Must be must be just bad luck, I guess. For me, with the Tesla. Odd. I honestly, I want one just because it farts. Because of what? Because it farts. I would probably get one if I could customize my horn. It farts? Yeah, it farts. Yeah, you 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 can can... get a farting horn. Oh! Every single time you hit a stop sign, it can fart. Like, farts all the time. Different kinds, different variations. I just want that fart. But why? Why not? Okay. <laughs> the car is passing gas constantly. Okay, I can see that. I can see that. Okay. Wow. <laughs> Teslas. <laughs> but there's something I wanted to talk to you guys about tonight. Um. Wow, we went from weird sex stories to Teslas. We are such a diverse group. I know. I know. It's kind of we're all weird and awkward at the same time. I'm still so waiting for Rebecca to say Uwu. Yeah, I'm still waiting for you to say ooh woo. Ooh woo. Not you, Not Becca. You. Oh. I told you we'll sell your hot dog water in time. It's free. Ah 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 ah. Unten Goku. What what's your new name now? Fucking Nerd Kame. Nerd Kame. Yeah, you want to use my government? Sneaky. Not in the chat. There you go. Sneaky. 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 Nikita Fuck Banana. You. Fuck you, Sneaky. Yeah. Fuck you. We should get that. We should get that. 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 We should get that on a t-shirt. Fuck you. That is bringing. That that is bringing negative. That could hurt us. Let's let's not. Let's not. Let's not. But fuck her. We can edit that out. Fuck. I know it's live. It don't matter. But she's too late. There's three way. people in. Fuck. There's three people watching. Hello, three people. There's three people watching. Hello, three people. I thought <laughs> Fuck her and her foundation. Okay, now you're making it obvious. Shut up, Sneaky. Wow. You're making it too yeah. obvious. Shut the fuck up. Well, she's just mad because her foundation don't match her skin I, 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 I. She needs to work on her blood. Anyway. I'm pretty sure that's the least of her problems. I'm like, okay. dude. I <laughs> anyway. Oh my god. Anyway, let's talk about Have you guys noticed that when you're a little kid and you get sick, the next few days you're okay, but as an adult, as you get older, you get sick one time and it's like the feeling just lingers longer. Well, yeah, cuz you got to do better. You got to put more effort into keeping your immune system up otherwise. I don't even think it's that because when you're sick, you get to stay home from school, you get to rest, you get to recover, and as an adult, it's harder to do that, That's because good. even if you take a day off, this. like, yeah, you have to go to work, you have to take care of your kids, you have to go and make sure this then the other's done, you have to feed other people, you don't really get a chance to let your body, like, take it and recover. Mm-hmm. You 
call off on your job still trying to fucking get you to come in. That reminds me of a fucking story. <laughs> like, you're, like, I'm dying. Exactly. Like, okay. Do you not know during the fucking... The um, there, right? Sorry, say what? Exactly. Said, yeah, you, you, you tell them I'm dying there, but you're still coming to you. You need somebody to come look, pick you up? Look, get look. You. If you guys remember that there was, like, a snowstorm in Chicago, like, two weeks ago, just two weeks ago, and I called off from work because my car <laughs> stopped running. And it was too cold outside. I couldn't get out. I got stuck. And do you not know that these oh my God. dumb, kind-hearted people said that we can use the company car to come pick you up, Coleman? I'm like, uh... Nah. <laughs> nah, if you want to get stuck, hey, be my guest. Nicky, my, Nicky, my you block is in trouble. Nah. Nicky, you playing uh, Black Ops? Yes. Uh, he's always been. He's in a private match. I'll, I'll, I'll. Because I tried to join private. him earlier and he didn't let me in. So. Come, come first on. off, come on, first come off, you. you didn't, you didn't say nothing, ma'am. It's me. That whole, that that whole, uh, that whole mind reader stuff. Nah, don't, don't, no, we don't do that here. Sneaky I did say something. That. First of all. Yeah, I know how it feels like to, for people to think that you're a mind reader. Got it. But anyways, the whole thing Oh, no, thing I ran is, out of ammo. The whole you thing is, that. I did. I did. I told you, you I'm like, the oh, focus they on my asleep. face. I said the, the kids focus. fell asleep, and they were not in the living room anymore. The focus. Okay, so <laughs> just the died. focus don't got nothing to do with wait, me, I asked. Wait, you hold didn't up. Get I died. Off. Hold up. Chris, is your fucking Christmas tree still up? <laughs> <laughs> your fucking Christmas tree still a fuck up. It's we need to put a sensor bar right here. <laughs> Mine still is. Oh my Our... god, why are your Christmas tree still up? See, we have a small one, like a tiny one that's on the table. Oh, well, he has oh. a fucking huge one. That's in the fucking corner of the wall. Leave him alone. Leave him. I can't show you the tiny one. That's I happen to one. like Christmas. It's over. <laughs> Get over it, Chris. Brendan. It's time for it, Mark. You guys get over it. What the fuck? <laughs> it's you don't women, like it up? It's Juan, you come over money. here and take it down. I'll burn that shit down. Pay for my ticket. Well, it's, it's, right woman, it's Woman's History Month, and I'll put a fucking tampon on it for y'all. Oh. <laughs> Decorate. I hate you. Oh, God. Why, Chris? Why? You know what? I now I want to see it. I want to see tampons all over that tree. With a maxi pet star on the top. <laughs> oh, he's gonna do it. I Is that a you. challenge? I, I challenge you. I dare game. you. Say it won't. Say it won't. won't. If you, you do won't. that, no balls. Sneaky, if you do no that, balls. that, Sneaky, if you do that, you have to record yourself doing it. No balls. I want to see it. Go to the dollar store. Get some red paint. I want them decorated with red gl red glitter on the on the tip. <laughs> <laughs> the whole nine. As a married man, I do have a, I have a, I have a wife. Why don't I just go authentic and get it straight from the tap? Oh God. I mean, if you want to have that fishy tree, that's cool. But I was just gonna say decorative. Oh, 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 they ain't nothing. They ain't nothing fishy there. If you're getting that straight from the, if you're getting a tampon straight from the tap, that shit's gonna be fishy. If not the first day, the next couple days. Yeah, okay. it's gonna be sitting here. Baking in the hot ass room exactly. for a while. Exactly, and he lives in, in in a southern state. Just so everybody knows, I live in Georgia. Georgia, Tennessee. So them things are gonna be like deep fried baked fish. Am I fucking They're gonna. It's gonna be everything. It's gonna be ripe. Am I it's gonna be ripe. It's gonna be deadly. It ain't gonna be ripe. But gonna be fucking you ain't gonna death. do it. No balls. It's I want to see a, that tree. This is worse than caustic gas. That shit gonna smell like First catfish off, nuggets. Catfish nuggets. First. This is going to be really hard to explain to my wife why I need <laughs> 300 fucking tampons. How are you going to red first paint? Off, first off, how are you going to stick it inside her multiple times to fucking hang it on the Christmas tree? He gonna double you dip. actually it's don't like know how sex works. He's going to get the chip. So right she's going to have to be asleep, one. and you got to take it one by one. Just now, she can be awake just so she can contribute to she's the not going to pop him over. She's not going to let him do that. I can see that shit going down right now. He literally gonna stick his pinky in there and be like, "That's pure, pure, that's pure." <laughs> that's that's pure, period blood right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hit, hit, it, hit it with the. <laughs> yup, my gum is numb. 
No. <laughs> That's some real oh. shit. What? <laughs> he gonna do that. Oh god. That's <laughs> kill. <laughs> oh. No one knows what to do. That's disgusting. Yeah. Then I he think goes, I'm gonna hang tampons goes, on my chair. Th then he goes for the second one, and it has a whole blood clot hanging from his finger. Oh. <laughs> Where we're from in the biz, we call that a blood diamond. A blood diamond. <laughs> Is it all chewy <laughs> shit? Is it all chewy shit, Chris? You taste it? <laughs> Shut the fuck up! Like liver. <laughs> oh god. It tastes like liver. Oh god. <laughs> I'm sorry, Becca. <laughs> you guys are just fucking disgusting. Thank you, what we, thank you, what we doing? You guys are uh, fucking disgusting. We're decorating his tree with tampons, apparently. <laughs> okay. So, he's he he's tonguing his can. Outbreak. This is not to offend anybody. That's why I said that this oh, uh, this you know viewer discretion oh, is advised oh, on the on the link on the on description. Viewer discretion is advised. Eighteen and plus stream, so no one can get offended or butt hurt over the, what we're talking about. But people are offended I mean, by Eminem. He has a parental. Technically, you're asking them not to because it's just you know jokes. Yeah, but they're still gonna these, be offended. These, these, Where'd you go, Sneaky? The devil's gonna get offended. If uh the, the two people that are watching, if you want, give us something to talk about. You know, if you have a question, ask away. But back to this conversation of the the whole. Okay, shoot, photo. Are you gonna? Are you going to decorate your tree? I don't think he is. I don't think he got the balls. Yeah, that's Just what I want to. Go with a tamp, no, with a yeah, maxi I'll, pad I'll, I'll star on the tree. So damn literal, like just leave that man What's alone. What's up? Hey, she, she, I can do that too. She wants him to do it, and he said challenge accepted. No balls. They have to be used tampons, um, Chris. They have to be used tampons. No, you. F <laughs> I have kids. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not trying to have my kids eat them. Yeah, like next thing they know, oh, it's candy. Because <laughs> we we already know some fucked up stuff already happened to sneak, so we don't need more <laughs> more traumatizing things to happen to to the girl. Don't decorate your Christmas tree with tampons. Don't do that. I would I would tell that story, but I feel like someone would take it the wrong way, and CPS would be at my house. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> take your kids. We definitely don't want we don't anything happening that. to them. Ah, oh, fuck it. Go. Statue limitation. This happened like a couple, like two years ago. Don't do it. Oh don't god. Do it. Don't do it, Chris. Should I? Should I tell the story? No. <laughs> it's a. It's a good story. story. What are we talking about? Oh god. Okay. Well, I'm not responsible for what might happen. Okay, go right ahead. Oh, come on. We're not that big. So, anyway. All right. So. Everybody's not that big when it first started. Me. Off. Me. Yeah, next thing you know, a few years now, from down the line, there's going to be like, oh, Sneaky Banana has been. Look, man. <laughs> if, if, ra if rappers can openly talk about killing people and doing drugs, I can fucking talk about this. Okay. Okay. Let's hear right, it. Okay. Let's hear what it. What is this about? What is this about? See, see, Brenda already knows the story. I don't think the rest of y'all heard it. Kendall, you heard it too. John, you didn't hear this one. You I've known have, you for how long, anyway. and I don't know. Here's a good one. So no, answer my question oh, first. Oh, 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 before you start, where'd you go? Answer my question first. I've known you for how long, and I don't know. Okay, I don't know. this is the part Earth. Where did you go? I tell you everything, fuckface. Joining you now. Uh. So anyway, John. I'm ready for story Okay, keep ignoring me then. We're going to talk later. Son of a bitch. Okay. So you're going to find so out right now. Come on. Me, me, me and my wife got a little adventurous and bought a ring. Oh. No particular type of ring. Just a ring. Are you sure? What kind of ring, Sneaky? What kind of ring? You, like this ring or like this ring it, or like this it ring? It kind of made a humming sound. Oh, so it was a dick ring. So. For, I believe the proper term. For the... For the, for the <laughs> For 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 the story purpose, it got cleaned every time we were done using it. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Because you know yep. that's disgusting. Mm -hmm, very. So, Luna, first figuring out how to walk. Oh God. I I, I happen to walk out into the living room and I see her chewing on something. Oh God. I'm like I'm like, hey honey, what you got there? I don't remember giving you gummy lifesaver. Oh, no, no, no. That's not a gummy lifesaver. <laughs> Daddy needs that back now. <laughs> oh, give me, give me. That's not, that's not candy, and it's going in the trash. So you mean to tell me that... 
Yeah, baby. she chewed a cock ring. Don't tell her that when she gets older. Don't tell oh, her we're that. definitely don't... telling her that. Oh, God, no. Oh, no, no, oh, yeah. no, no. Without no. a doubt. Little girl like Especially if she, if when, right, if, hold, when she gets right, married. Right, hold up. Hold up. Uh, Kendall. I just called you by your fucking name. My bad. Jamal. Gruesome. We'll edit that out. We'll put a beep there. Definitely Why are we in a public match? People know our names on Facebook. You're the only Why one that shared it. I deactivated my Facebook. My Facebook ain't working right now. Either. Why are we in a public match? Oh, shit. Okay, my bad. Who the hell is Dax? I, I and where's Jack? I don't know. Fuck him, though. So, that I was a weird... I'll break, I'll break because it's with you. That was a weird-ass story. I hope you never tell her it's that. Not, it's not weird. You're right, it's disgusting. It happens, it is disgusting. especially you when you, you have kids. Like, you don't, you don't, you want to weird having your kid walk in on you while you're new, your infant child walk in on you while you're trying to, like, bump uglies. And then, not only I don't think it matters. I think it doesn't even matter. I think when your kid walks in on you no, no, in no, general, no, 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 whether no. they're this a child. This one in particular that I'm talking about is when, it's not the fact that he walked in, it's how he looked when he walked in. And you might not remember. I fucking do. Cause I, me and him made eye contact. We like. <laughs> no, no, no. My son, Eli, my son Elias. You know, me Some and his mother. do the darndest things. Something ugly. Right? Or we trying to. And for whatever reason, you know, we thinking he's sleep. He didn't got up. He walking around. This little motherfucker popped the door open. And he like, what you doing? <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, no, and I looked at him, I looked at him, and he looked at me, and I'm just like, I can't do it. And she's like, it's fine, it's fine. I'm like, no, like, he's looking right at me, like, no. <laughs> like, that, it, look, he was like, he wasn't even one yet. Or I think he was only one. And he just, like, head just crept in a room. It was, it was, it fucked me all up. I'm just like, no. And she, honestly, fine, what fine. you should have like, done no. is, you should have stared him directly in the eye and finished to assert your dominance. No. <laughs> I can't do that. I can't do that. No. She didn't that, care, obviously. But that's like, disgusting. That, that, no. <laughs> this is my mommy now. <laughs> Look at me. Look at me. This is my mommy now. <laughs> that's so funny. I like. I honestly don't think it matters because, like, I have so many friends. Like, it never happened to me, ever. Thank God. But. I know so many of my friends that they've had instances where they walked in on their parents as teenagers and even as adults. I got a story. Man, I, got I heard my mom there. and I heard my mom and her crackhead boyfriend going at it and spoiler yeah, alert, I, they're both like fucking I sixty. In, I, I walked in on my mom getting her ass ate not once but twice. Oh but good God. Oh my once when I was once when I was nine and when I was twenty. Oh god. Bent over the fucking deep first time I was in the bed. Again, I was nine. We were still in foster care, so this was our weekend to go be with our mom. So we were to be over there, and her friend Rodney. It's late at night, you know. I got up to just walk around, and I was like, I, it's like the little hallway I got a pass that's like goes directly into the, her room. There's no door there, so it's really just like an open door. And yeah, fucking yams in the air, fucking. Ju- ju- Getting this Kevin Gates on, and you know, it's just, <laughs> and then again when I was twenty, I was twenty. You know, it was me. I was with my ex girlfriend at the time and my best friend Michael, and I was stopping at my house to pick up my PlayStation Three so I could send it in because it was malfunctioning. And I was trying to see if I could get it fixed, so I had to mail it. So uh, I went home to go pick up uh, my fucking PlayStation Three, and yeah. 20 years old, walked in on my mom, bent over the deep freezer in the kitchen with some fucking dude. Just, just, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Not the deep freezer. <laughs> I'm just Not like. The deep freezer. And I, I kind of just stood there and I'm just like. <laughs> and then I turned around and I walked out. I didn't say shit. I don't even, she, I don't even think she saw me. But I turned around. I don't around, think she did either. She was. Busy. Yeah, she was, she was lost in the sauce, so to speak. So, she you know. lost I'm, in the sauce. I'm, so I turned around. <laughs> Walked out and I, I just I was quiet the whole time from the minute I left the house till I got in the car and I got in the car and I told Celeste I'm just like just go and she was like what's wrong I'm like just drive 
He like, my boy, like, my boy, like, what's you do? I was like, just fucking grab, dude. Just, just don't, don't, just don't bring it up. Fucking go. We don't talk about this no more. We don't. We would never mention this ever again. See, I'm like, what's wrong? I'm just, don't even worry about it. Just go. Cool. I'm fine. Just Thank drive. God Please. I have never walked in on my mom. That's a very compromising having position. sex. <laughs> but I have walked in on my grandfather having sex. Uh, no. I walked in on my dad. I walked in on my grandfather. Naked. This is what happened. This is what ha- my my grandfather was like, probably sixty something or seventy something at the fucking time. This is what fucking uh, happened. I was um, in the oh, kitchen man. with my auntie playing my Game Boy. My aunt told me, she said, go tell granddaddy that the food is ready. So I said, oh, okay. I put my Game Boy down. I walk towards da- down the hall past the bathroom where my grandfather's room is. I knock. Don't hear uh, don't hear nothing. I open the door. I say, granddaddy, auntie Yvonne said. And then I see my grandfather's ass and this old lady that visit the night before legs in the air and my grandfather struggling to, to, to just just get his stroke on and it was like I, oh, I no. god damn it John I told you goddamn no <laughs> the room the room <laughs> the room was so hot and sweaty and smelled of old hot people I bet, I bet, I bet you it smelled like metal muscle up in there. <laughs> it smelled like something <laughs> it smelled like the something the sense of silver was strong with this one but he stopped I'll walk in, I'll walk he in stopped in looked at me I'm looking at him he looking at me I'm looking at him he looking at me I slowly close the door and I just Creep on, <laughs> creep and go back. He said, "You told Granddad." I was like, "Yeah, I did." I did. <laughs> I oh walked my in God. on my dad when I was ten, and let, let, I put it like this: he was very well endowed, and it made sense why you know I got the genes I fucking got, right? So I'm ten. Body armor. I'm ten, and we were visiting my dad and everything, right? And I walked in on him. Um, I walked in the room to ask him something. At this point, I don't even fucking remember what it was about. I really don't. At this, this is literally like twenty years or like twenty some years ago, and I still don't fucking remember what I was going to ask him. So I go in there, right? And he just got out the shower. Now my dad was a pretty big fucking dude. You think I'm a big dude? My dad's like maybe twice my size, right? And so I walk in the room, and I'm just like, "Hey, dad, can I?" And he turned around, he was like, oh, what you need? And I'm just, like, like kind of just standing there again. This is, like, when you don't know how to react to a situation, so you don't say shit at all. And he's so, I'm just like, and he's like, oh, what's, what's wrong, son? I'm just, nothing. Walked off. <laughs> Looked like a whole fucking elephant trunk hanging from this fucking <laughs> <head>. <laughs> You know, just no no shame. Just all, just mm-hmm. horse cock. Just straight fucking horse cock with this dude. Mm-hmm. And I'm just sitting there, and yeah, it, it fucked me up a little bit. I ain't gonna lie. I, I literally <laughs> forgot what I was even asking him. Like, I was just like, okay, I'm just gonna go fuck off. All right, never mind. <laughs> Excuse me, sir, but you have a baby arm hanging from your pelvis. <laughs> a baby arm hanging from the pelvis. Nah, that was more like a fucking elephant trunk. But, you know. You, you only you, had you, elephant you, trunk in it. Donkey dick. <laughs> said donkey dick. Horse dick. No, I think, or like, that MPEG. I think, um, I remember that Halia's dad had told me, well, he lived on the third floor and his parents were, um, were beneath him, but then he had to move into the basement, so then he was up under them and he literally could hear what positions they were in and they were very loud and <sighs> all that. Oh, God. And when they would switch, when they would move, when he was standing on, on the floor, when his dad would stand on the floor. And then he also told me that his mom used to have parties with his with her friends. Wait, where what, what she kind had, of parties? She would have some lady come in and bring in a bag of toys. And they would try them out to test them to see if they liked them. Oh, mama and, was freaky uh, freaky. All three of her children knew exactly what was happening. They were aware what they were doing. They just stayed away. I would have stayed but away. But he was like, they, they they could hear them downstairs. You know, I think I think as you get older... I need kinda, an adult. Yeah, I need an adult too. But I think as you get older, you kind of try to spice up your sex life because... They ain't got shit to do with doing if that you, right yeah, but If, you, if so you're with somebody... He, he was, 
for so he long. He was 17 at the time, and his little brothers were maybe like still in the elementary school. And okay, they well, were all mind. aware of what was happening. You're trying, you're trying to spice up your sex life. Okay, you can spice that shit all you want, but do it when you got damn kids ain't around. <laughs> Well, it's kind of hard to do when kids are around because they're always all around. So then go somewhere else. That shit was so weird to me because one time they literally just tried to, like, rush me out the house. And I'm like, what's going on? Like, what's the problem? And they explained to me what was going to happen within a few minutes. And I'm like, they like, bitch, go. Okay, let's go. (laughs) It's time to go home now. It's time to go home. And I remember that one of the, the smallest one, he was just like, as we were walking out, they had already started, and you can hear one of the like the their aunts kind of like making their noises, and the little one, the little brother, was just like, huh, huh. <laughs> he's like, let's go, and I was like, what the hell? That was really weird. For I me. got the boot. Def, that, that that family was freaky, freaky. Like, I'm about to pick my nose on stream. I mean, pick your nose on stream. That's like disgusting. It- That's disgusting. <laughs> I got lung disease. Jesus the medicine Christ. I take. Makes my nose really crusty and it starts to hurt, so I gotta pick it or I start having nosebleeds. Pile everything up, save it. That's no, don't, don't, Maybe don't, I can don't get... make this like a, a cum sock where no. mushrooms <laughs> and shit grow on top of it. I stuck my foot. I stuck my. I what? stuck my. Actually, I have a very recent one. I stuck my foot in my cum sock like two days ago. You have a cum sock? <laughs> Mm-hmm. Why, why don't you have a cum rag? Because the closest thing to me was a sock. Oh. <laughs> I'm, I'm so sorry, Becca. <laughs> anything, is a, any, anything has the potential to be a cum rag, I'm sorry. I That's guess true. so, yeah. So he, he didn't know if it was the sock that he used or not, so he stuck whatever, his foot man. in it. Whatever, bro. First off, I picked up the sock. I picked it up from the top part where the ankle is. And it, and it didn't feel like I, I've been sweating in it because it was a sock that I wore from the previous day. I'm like, okay, this feels like a new sock. It's clean. I put my I, I put my foot in. I'm like, okay, this is a little loose. I guess it didn't dry all the way. And then I stepped down. <laughs> Yo. I'm not going to get too vulgar because I know we still got to follow some guidelines. But my volume for a dude is kind of up there. It felt like a Play-Doh fun factory between my toes from fucking hell. <laughs> oh, God. R.I.P. Sneaky's kids. <laughs> R.I.P. Sneaky Sneaky kids forever and ever. Speaking of forever, <laughs> speaking of rest in peace, um, Timmy. I love Timmy. Who the fuck is Timmy? Timmy. Timmy. And Bartholomew. You know who Bartholomew is? Rest in peace forever, uh, I thought you were talking about Timmy from South Park. That's my bad. That's my no, bad. No, no, Jesus Timmy. Christ. No, Timmy That's and, oh. and Bartholomew. Gen, uh, Bartholomew Chungus. Chungus Snaps. Chungus. Chungus Ginger Snaps the third. No, I know you don't. <sighs> what in the fuck are you talking about? R.I.P. for up and ever, Sweet Prince. R.I.P. Okay, there's this, there's this dude on TikTok, right? Um... He portrays a little kid named Timmy. Okay, so Timmy's parents gave him a Shakespeare book at the age of whatever. So he's in elementary school, like, insulting people and cursing people out. And Shakespearean fashion. Yes, in a Shakespearean fashion. So with all the old language, English words and whatnot, calling doctors, right. necromancers, mm-hmm. and, like, they Bite thy thumb. Yeah, like, there was a recent one with the, with, with the doctor. And Which the was like a said, really good old fashioned way of saying go fuck yourself. Yeah, the um doctor said he has given two shots. The doctor gives him two shots and I know who you're talking about now. I know who you're yeah, talking about. He gets now. all over dramatic with it and he starts He's basically like, oh, cursing out. <laughs> you got you guys really think that's funny? It is funny. It's hilarious. Oh uh, okay. he says, Okay, so you have to take take, take off your lower pants. Your pants. <laughs> he just slaps the shit out of him. <laughs> How do you not like Timmy? Like, that shit is hilarious. I don't know. He's just not funny. Oh, God. You're not funny. I mean, that ain't everybody's cup of tea, and that's okay. Give me one of those. Thanks, boyfriend. I'm just saying. Yeah, they have a weird relationship. Oh, my God. Let's not get into that now. Yeah, let's not. Uh, I'll get it. First of all, our love (laughs) will not be judged. You're married. You're married, Sneaky. You can't have a side piece. He's so married. are half of the people in Hollywood. Hey, What's hey, your hey, point? Hey. In order to be a side piece, you got to agree to it, which I did. 
so it's okay. He, first of all, no, he's not a side piece, according to Sneak. Tell us what you said earlier. I'm he, no, don't worry about it. No, we're going to camera now. Say it. You got to say it. He's only married to make this, this one true love. You got to say it. No, he said oh. that <laughs> he owns. I'm not going to say it. You say it. Say it. No ball. I'm only, I'm, I'm only married. So I can, for so I can have more kids. <laughs> but he's the one true love. He sounded like he was okay, struggling to say that. <gasps> so I can be clear, he said he's married for procreation, but but uh, Gruesome is his one true love. And gruesome is that dude. So, is that dude way over there next to Brenda? And you can you, t- and you I can did, take that to the bank. I wanted to snitch on him. And <laughs> what are you? It perfect. It was a perfect setup. And now, he, she he snitched on himself, and now his wife is going to see this video, and then he might not be alive tomorrow. Watch your back. He might not be. <laughs> watch your back. <laughs> <laughs> watch your back. I was thinking, do you do you sleep hard or are you a life sleeper? <laughs> uh, I'm a very 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 heavy sleeper. Oh, Apparently, yeah, you what happened. Die. You might die. What happened speak. today was apparently Luna got up before all of us and she was just standing in my face screaming and crying. You know what all kids do when they first wake up for whatever reason. And my wife heard it and she comes out and she goes, how come you didn't wake up? I was like, I, I don't know. <laughs> you so didn't hear just... her? I'm like, not at all. So she didn't like touch you or nothing, try to shake you? No, my kids think it's funny just to scream in my face until I wake up. Seems oh. fair. Okay. That my sense. oldest almost got punched for that because I didn't know what it was. I heard, <laughs> I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. It's not funny, but it, I'm, I'm, I'm going to shut up. No, it, it was funny. I was, I hear, I hear, <laughs> I'm like, Start waking up. I'm like, what the fuck is that? Is that the wind? <laughs> I'm like, oh hey, no, yeah, something's in front of me. <laughs> it's a zombie. <laughs> something's in front of me. Death machine right here. Something's in front of I'm me. I'm coming. Something's gonna kill me. Oh god. My my, I did think it was a zombie. My thing about zombies was, um, what got me so heavy into zombie type games was my older brother used to bring his PlayStation over. God, this was like forever ago. And he would play Resident Evil 1 Director's Cut, you know, the really scary one. Mm-hmm. And I used to sit here and watch and watch that religiously. Now, me with having the ADD of 10 men, I have a very hyperactive imagination. Mm-hmm. Which is why I'll never live in a big house, because it reminds me of uh, the mansion from uh, Resident Evil 1. True that. Uh, Speaking of Resident Evil... If you didn't play Resident Evil in the early 90s, then you don't fucking understand. When you're a kid, and you're playing a game, but like, games like Resident Evil, House of the Dead, that, that shit, to, for, like, for some weird reason, when I was a kid, I, like, linked House of the Dead with railroad tracks, and every time I passed them, I had, like, a mini panic attack, and I have no fucking clue where uh-huh. this game from. Mm. Facts. So, I go into a big-ass house. No. I start getting anxiety, because I think... Yawn, which is the name of the giant snake that you fight in Resident Evil 1, is going to be creeping around somewhere. What? I got I got another zombie story. Oh, God. It's right okay. here. Somewhere. Go ahead. So, story. so, I forget what zombie movie. I think I was watching Resident Evil and I was also playing at the same time because that's what you do when you're a psychopath. Oh, it disappeared. Uh-huh. So we go to visit Grandma's house, which is in South Carolina. Right, right. So we go there, yada yada yada. We're all happy to see each other. And was I smoking at the time? No, I was vaping at the time. And I go out to vape because even though vape is a slightly better alternative. Now I'm using quotes so no one's like, well, actually, actually, I don't give a shit. <laughs> well, so actually. I go outside to be polite. I go outside to be polite, and her grandmother breeds Pomeranians. But of course, Grandpa gets attached to them and they never sell them, so. So how do you, how do they sell Pomeranians? So, so, they used to. So, apparently there was an accident with one, and its lower jaw got ripped off. Now, 
They never told me. I'm sitting there doing my thing vaping. And you know that weird seventh sense where you realize something's in, like, your field? It's usually when you know something's within five feet around you in some direction. Mm -hmm. I look over and I see this dog with no lower jaw. It looks like fucking hell. (laughs) Its tongue's all hanging out. (laughs) And the first thing I'm thinking is this thing's going to fucking bite me like a Cerberus (laughs) dog from Resident Evil. I almost killed this damn thing. I was so scared. I was... I'm already light-skinned. I I turn white. Mm. And I'm like, wait a minute. It's just barking. Ew, it's barking. It has no lower jaw. So I wonder how you're going to feel about extremely tall, big-chested women. First off, first off, let me say this for the record. I don't know where that men are afraid of a strong, independent woman. Most dudes, we're not. Someone who's nine foot doesn't scare me, because guess what? I'm just going to kill her like every other Resident Evil boss. <laughs> so this is giving like, us... What? Her official height is like, what, nine feet tall? Yeah, nine feet she's tall. Like, she's feet like nine tall, foot right? six inches. That's over a tall here, bitch. Over here climbing Mount Everest and shit. You know what I'm saying? That's a tall bitch. That's Kill up and oh, I I can't wait. So I think, that song, I think that game actually comes out right before uh, Elias's birthday. It comes out on the ninth of yep. uh, May. Hey, yeah, his birthday is the seventeenth. So, well, we don't want to keep I'm you guys up too long with our conversations, but we will be yes, probably do. doing this more often with the late nights, let's and talk, we'll have. Let's talk more about snakes love. Let's not. I'm gruesome over here. Let's not. We're about to wrap it up. We're about to wrap it up. My love knows hey, no bounds. Sneaky, sneaky, look at the camera. We're about to wrap it up. No one wants Te to amo. know about no one wants to know about you guys' this forbidden. Te amo, amor. Nah, you just mad because you ain't a part of this shit. I don't want to be a part of this Stop. shit. I'm I'm I am happy. <laughs> I am happy being outside. Mac, part of. I don't want to be a part of it. But anyway, yes, you, you, you in, <sighs> anyway, come on, John, no. John, join on in, no. John, join on in. No, we I'm can sorry. be a giant. We can be a giant fudge brownie. No, no, no. no. I put caramel on it. With the caramel. Oh God, no! Not the caramel. No, not the caramel. No. I'm gonna give you some of that caramel drizzle. Oh, you guys have ruined caramel for me for the rest of my life. No. Oh God, no. Okay, so we're gonna wrap it up here. Thank you for coming to the LG Late Night Show. No, I'm ending it. I am. Y'all, not the wrong. No, stop it. No. Anyway, do you guys do you guys have They're any? They're gonna stroke your beard. God, I'm gonna, gonna shave this beard now. I'm, I'm gonna, gonna, I'm gonna call you. I'm gonna call you. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna call you a chocolate a lo- lollipop gill. Oh, so chocolate lollipop? No. Yeah, I said that shit. <laughs> okay, okay. So, there's anything that you guys wanna wanna um tag in? Like anything that you guys wanna say before I end it? And don't know nothing about caramel or lollipop guild or whatever. Nothing, nothing like that. Hopefully, you sometime later. soon. You went, you were um, I can't say the rest for the rest of the crew, but when um. I finally get my computer back up and running. I will be streaming Resident Evil 8 Village, so look out for that. Okay, all right. Uh, on Instagram, I'm still trying to get on Twitter. I don't tweet, but I'm trying. I'll think about it. Follow us on there, too. We're going to try to get some TikToks going. Follow John on OnlyFans. <laughs> Follow me and Gruesome on OnlyFans. Do I have a Only we fans? Are... <laughs> Our only Chocolate fans is called. Only fans it's called me, me and Chris Chocolate Banana all day every Chocolate day. Chocolate Banana, if brown and black. We'll, we'll, we'll if, you guys wanna, covered if, banana. if you guys want to see me eat cereal in uwu, then yes, follow my Only fans. We'll, we'll be streaming <laughs> exclusive content for all the man love out there. All, 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 all the man love. Romances. Gruesome and Sneaks Only fans is called Chocolate Covered Banana, yeah. and you know how it got there. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> okay. Also, we will be revamping the merchandise store, uh, where we actually get everything situated merch-wise and figuring out some bugs and kinks and whatnot. Whatnot. We will be giving you guys more merch to buy, per se. But we will also be giving you guys Jesus, better prices 
for the merchandise. I know the prices right now are kind of steep with Streamlabs and whatnot, but it's not my fault. We're working it's, on it. Yeah, it's Streamlabs' fault. Like, we're not making much of a profit with Streamlabs, so we're thinking about, you know, we are going to go away from Streamlabs when it comes down to the merchandise. Like, all in all, it's a good streaming service and whatnot, but merch-wise, they're killing us. They're, they're, they're definitely killing us. Basically, what they put down, we can't really afford to be picking up anymore. Yeah, exactly. So, we're going to actually be revamping the merch store. <laughs> And Monica says drop the OnlyFans. I'm not dropping the OnlyFans. It's only for people who want to pay. Serious hey, inquiries Monica. only in the DM, okay? Serious inquiries only. Monica, don't worry. Only. I got you. I'll send you the link. We'll get you his link. We'll get you, uh, what is it, chocolate covered bananas link. We'll, we'll, we'll put those links in. John's there. OnlyFans is called Tan Man Yams. <laughs> Tan <laughs> Man Yams. Oh, my God. Also, no. if you want to... If you want to follow uh, me and Sneaky's OnlyFans, you know, individually, mine's just chocolate-covered yams. His is banana-flavored yams, you know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> okay. So also, we're... a lot of us are starting to uh, stream on Twitch. Uh, I just barely figured out how to do it from the PlayStation, and I don't yeah. have... I don't know how to do it exactly, so you can't hear me talk, but you can watch me play. I'm horrible. I just started playing... Uh, on a PlayStation 4 about a few years ago, and I'm still getting it's already 4. Okay. And, and, um, and as usual, you can follow me on my streaming page on Nerd Kami. That's N E R D K I M two eyes. N E R D. We'll drop the links in the in the comments for yeah. everyone to look into it. The Twitches, the Instagrams. Join us on Discord. We literally have conversations like this all the time that aren't recorded, and they're really funny um aside from that we play on there you can watch john play um final, final fantasy, fantasy or other we play call, call, call of duty every night call of duty every single night every single night sometimes till five in the morning sometimes till two or three we're here um i don't know what all damn i look really fat in this white shirt white is definitely not my color <laughs> <laughs> but those boobies look nice. It's cool. Uh, I thought I was a tropical Mexican. Look, I look, look fucking look. Samoan. Squeeze, squeeze so together, Samoan. squeeze together the titties, and then go ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, no. Uh -huh. <laughs> okay, so that's, no. that's it for LNG. We will see you guys on the next misadventure. Say bye bye <laughs> to the happy people. Be cool. Stay black. Becca. Say goodbye huh? to the happy people. Bye bye. Stay <laughs> <laughs> All right, she bye, folks. She, she hit us with the. <laughs> <laughs>